What's happening guys? My name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new video and in this tutorial I'm gonna create a really really amazing explosion and you guys have to see this and as you can see right now I'm currently in the woods because I'm going to do this video right here and currently I'm on a holiday But you guys know me even though I have vacation. I still want to create videos I'm gonna show you guys exactly what I mean with this awesome explosion So I would say I'll catch you guys obviously right after the intro <laughs> All right guys, so as you can see right now, we are in this uh, beautiful open space and as you can see, I have two things uh, that I brought with me. I'm just gonna show you guys. Right guys, so what I brought with me today is this glass, as you can see, and a can of uh, gasoline that I'm gonna create the explosion with. Now I want to mention that don't try this at home uh, because we're gonna create an explosion in the editing process so maybe I shouldn't tell this but this is not really gasoline. Make this explosion a little bit more realistic and what I also have with me is a pack of cigarettes because we need to dump a lighting cigarette into the glass of gasoline to create the explosion. You guys know what I'm trying to say? Okay so what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill up the glass with gasoline. So I'm gonna just put the glass down and I'm gonna place a little bit of gasoline into the glass. Like that. Okay. Put this guy aside for a second. Okay, the next thing we need to do is we need to light a cigarette. So I also brought a lighter with me. If I can find it. Three hours later. Here's the lighter. Okay, so the next thing I need to do is basically light this guy up. And I'm not gonna do that yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and take some distance and then I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to create this awesome effect. Okay guys, I hope you guys can hear me because I have an external microphone right here and the camera's all the way back there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to light this cigarette. The cigarette is fully lighted, smoke's coming off. So I'm gonna take a little step back and I'm gonna dump it in. Three, two, one. So that is basically how to create this awesome explosion. I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to do that in Vegas Pro 15. So I would say, let's go to Vegas Pro 15. All right guys, so now that we are in Vegas Pro 15, this is basically the clip of me holding the cigarette and then a few frames later, as you can see, I just dropped it into the glass. So what we're gonna do is, as soon as I drop this, we're gonna zoom out first of all and add the explosion. So what we're gonna do is, first of all, we're gonna go to the beginning, then we're gonna go ahead and skip a few frames as you can see when it falls down I'm gonna cut it I'm gonna go to the event pan crop icon and I'm gonna just right click and press restore as you can see like that so this is what it looks like boom and then what we need to do is we need to make a photo of us out of the frame. So that's what I'm gonna, I'm gonna do as well. As you can see right here, I'm out of the frame. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on this little diskette icon and I'm gonna save that one. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna delete this big part and we're gonna add in this screenshot. I'm gonna delete this one and I'm gonna insert the photo. And once it drops in there, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and cut it right here and just, and just zoom out for a second. And then as you can see, this is what it looks like. Boom, and then I'm disappearing. Now we need to insert the explosion. So we're gonna go to production crate. And once we found the explosion on production crate, you wanna download it and this is basically the explosion we're gonna use. As you can see like that. So the only thing we need to do now is remove the black background. So right click, properties, click on media, and we wanna put the alpha channel to straight and matted. And we're gonna click on okay. And as you can see right now, we can now see through it. But what we need to do is we need to duplicate this track and the top one, we're gonna make that one a little bit bigger like that. And as you can see, that one looks really, really nice. What we also need to do is we need to put it a little bit before the actual image. So this is what it looks like right now. So once the explosion starts, we're disappearing.
So that is how it looks. Okay, that looks really nice. But to add in a little bit more detail, we're gonna go ahead and make the ground burn as well, just a little bit. So we're gonna create a new video track, put that guy right there. And then we're gonna go ahead and do the same, go to properties, media and then you want to click alpha channel straight and mad it so now we can see through the fire we're going to put the fire where we stood so we're going to do it like that so it looks like the ground is burning this is what it looks like right now and as you can see right now the ground is burning right there yeah excuse the lag guys i'm on the laptop not on my own pc so it's a little bit slower that's how amazing it looks so the only thing we need to do now is add in a sound effect and we need to just time it So that's how it's done guys. This is how you create a realistic explosion in Vegas Pro 15. I want to thank guys for watching and that's how to do it. Okay guys, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching and we are only a couple of hundred subscribers away from 200,000 and obviously we'll be giving away two Vegas Pro 15 copies, two full copies of Vegas Pro and the only thing you need to do is turn on the notifications on this channel because once we hit that milestone I'll be uploading an announcement video where you can enter, how you can enter, everything like that. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video make sure to subscribe down below if you're new and smash the like button down below and I'll catch you guys obviously in a brand new video. Maybe tomorrow, maybe on Friday, who knows. Stay tuned and I'll catch you guys next time.